Hello, my name is Jennifer and welcome to part 74 of the Foster Child Challenge. And if you are returning, welcome back. And we still have four toddlers in the house. <laughs> and I have three of them working with our three young adults because we still have Oliver who was adopted in the house and Noah actually just woke up and he's supposed to be going to get himself something to eat but he was a little bit slow about it. I thought I told you to do something Nicholas. <laughs> Nicholas what are you doing? You were supposed to come over here and try and uh, teach flashcards numbers to Jasmine, <laughs> we're on a push. Did you get the message? I need her to max her skills because she is older. Her and Maya are the two older ones. Yes, I'm like, why is... So Evie is just showing as older just because that's a glitch in the... Reach communication level three. What happened here? Oh, I think he completed his... I was like, why are we coming over to him? I think that was because he completed his his aspiration milestone for some reason. I'm not really sure what one what he had. I don't remember. I thought they'd all done that last time. So, oh well. So he needs to for work, compose a song or routine or paint a mural. But he has till Tuesday at 4 to do that. And it is only Sunday at 6. So we're not in a rush. We need to really work on these toddlers. So it looks like she's hungry. Why is she sad? Oh, tired of words from learn, trying to learn to talk. Poor little girl. But she's got to three, so that's pretty good. And she is hungry, so we'll let her go eat some turkey dinner. And and what is your problem? You seem a little, like, what are you going to do? You're going to clean up? Okay. You can clean up. Let's see. Did you still? You're busy talking to the to the butler which is nice yes but that's not what we need from you my dear is your no of course your potty is maxed you need your thinking okay why don't why don't we, we're gonna talk to the butler why don't you come and ask why why don't you do something useful when you're talking to the butler and you're gonna come over here and you're going to ask why <laughs> oops and then you're going to come over here and you're not listening to me at all. Maybe I canceled it by the, what I just did. You're going to ask why. Are you stuck? Are you stuck there? Is that your problem? Here, see if I... You're both stuck. Okay, here we're going to do is we're going to shift teleport you there. Is that your problem? Okay. Now, <laughs> I'm stuck. Why were you stuck there? Is the butler stuck? Maybe we should uh, reset the butler and see if she like starts moving because I don't know why she was so stuck and she's not okay can we try this again what is your problem can you come and actually ask why okay hopefully the butler like goes and looks after herself if that's the problem this person said I knew you before you were famous we need to go check out what this person's you're washing your hands or something do we know you? We do. We can ask you to leave, but let's check your, your traits. Is this Bianca? It's kind of hard to tell with the crazy hat on. We don't know your traits. Okay, well, we're going to come over here, and we're going to friendly. Um, we'll ask you about your career. Not that that really matters, but it gets us over there. And we need to get your traits, because you know what? I don't really like having strangers in my house when I don't know their traits. And it's not coming up with anything that I like. Let's see. Complimenting is not. She's a juice box at Make-A-Dish, so she must work with her. Well, she must have worked, <laughs> I should say. Oh, her spotlight is fading. I guess we're going to have to work on that a little bit if we want to keep it. Because she's going to be sad if she loses it. And she did actually complete her bestsellers. I don't, I think that maybe happened between parts. I'm not sure, but because I was struggling with bestsellers, but she got them all. So she's completed the best-selling author aspiration. So she's all done with that. She doesn't have really much for music <laughs> because she's not practiced any music for any time, but we may have her go over there. Does she have any books she can publish? Any non-bestsellers? Because I don't really like publishing. No. <laughs> 
they're all bestsellers, so she's not publishing any of them. Does she have any paintings over here? Yeah, we're going to have her go and sell that to the collector. So hopefully we can at least maintain that fame that she has. So let's check in. Let's check in on Jasmine. And there, the butler just reset. Ask why again. Oh, she's a snob. Well, snob is okay. I can handle I can handle that. We're going to study shape hot help and see if Nicholas can help us with that. Let's hope that that works. And you, Maya, you went outside, but you don't really need to be, although you need your imagination. And if you're dressed warmly enough, you could come over here and you can play dolls. And you know what? You kind of need to go potty. So you should come over here and get potty help from Oliver's right there. So hopefully that will work without any, without too much trouble. Really? You better? Yeah. <laughs> Do you know her? Why is she not even showing up here? She showed up right at the top for, um, at least she's in winter clothes. Is she leaving? Is that why she's not showing up? Oliver. Okay, we got some, right? Oh, we got the painting, the money from the painting. Okay, now he's going potty. She hopefully is going to learn her blocks. Oh, forget it. She's tired. What is your problem, Maya? I've been asking you to, like, work on this. Just study your shapes by yourself. You're not going to bed yet. I'm sorry. Are you stuck? What is going on? I don't... Let's uh, actually stick this in, say, Oliver's inventory in case that's in the way. Can you not get off of there because of that? Can you study shapes? We'll just stay with you and see if you actually start it. And then when you're finished, if you actually do that, maybe, Nicholas, what are you doing? You're making a snow angel. Okay, well, whatever. You're going to come here now <laughs> and teach shapes. Can we get it to work this way? And then you are playing with the dollhouse. You're going potty. You are eating. I hope you're actually eating. I certainly hope you are. And looks like you came. All right. So let, I think they're actually doing what they're supposed to do. So let's check in on Evie. Did she eat enough? Not really. Okay. Do you have your potty? Is it maxed? Nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. So you're going to come over here and you're going to use this potty with hopefully help from Lacey. Can you do that? We'll try and try and try. So this is excellent and we don't need it out. I don't think anyone's really that hungry, though she didn't actually get that full, did she, from her food. But you're going to go to the potty first. She, I don't even remember. Maybe she, maybe there wasn't very much left. Maybe that's why. So we're going to put that in the garbage to get out of the way. And hope that this works. Okay. You are going to go play outside. I thought I had you playing. Okay. You know what you're going to do? You come and read a book. You're going to read a book. And hopefully that will get you working on your imagination and in one place. Oh, so Patchy now is helping her. Are they both helping her? <laughs> I don't really know. And you're cleaning up a puddle. Uh, uh, you're going to clean that. And clean that. And then how is he? He's tired again. So then when you're going to finish with that, you're going to read him to sleep. I think this was his bed. I think I woke him up early because he was hungry and I didn't want him to like be too hungry. So we're doing that. She's looking at a book. He's going to go. I, I thought he was going back to bed, but maybe he's not going back to bed yet because Oliver is busy taking out garbage and stuff. And so hopefully he actually does take him to bed. She is getting really tired. So what we're going to do is we're going to give her a second wind under parenting, help with needs, give a second wind. That's what we want to try and do when we're finished with this. We are going to put her to sleep, but I'm hoping that she won't need to sleep as much if we do that. So she's almost finished. She has to go potty. 
So she didn't, obviously, well, it took so long for her to actually do what she was supposed to do that it's not surprising that she didn't max her thinking skill. She might have otherwise. So does that give her a bit of a boost to her energy? Uh, it did. Enough that now she can go to the potty. She can go sit here, go potty. And Oliver, where did you go? Oh, you're still coming all the way. Why did you go out to take that garbage out? I never asked you to do that, did I? I don't think so. You just did that on your own. Is that a club activity that I should be taking out of the club? Yes, it is a club activity, which I normally like, but <laughs> I don't like... Is this garbage... Can you not use this garbage? It's empty. Why are you not using the garbage can? Maybe if I put this out here? I mean, I have it in there to have it more convenient, but... <sighs> okay, you go potty. Oh, wrong, wrong sim. Hey, you go potty. You go potty. Because you got to level two, obviously, so you can go potty on your own. And even if it's dirty, you're going potty. And then Lacey is going to uh, potty train you. And you are going to now try and read Noah to sleep, like I said before. But she, I guess he couldn't get to the garbage because Lacey was standing there. So hopefully by... I usually like to have it by the potty so it's close and easy to empty. But obviously that did not work when someone was standing there <laughs> in the way. Yeah. I'm just trying to look around if I should like... Here, we'll put that in the garbage. There. And now he's... Oh, no. Oh, Nicholas is doing the cleaning. And she's going to bed because she is tired. So hopefully when she wakes up, we can get her to max that, that skill so that she can, you know, be aged up. That would be really, really good if she could. And so he's reading to sleep. How are your needs? You're a bit hungry because you didn't actually eat very much. You're going to come over here and you're going to grab a serving. And are you doing anything? Not really. So you're going to come over here and you're going to um, watch channel uh, between TV or not because that's not where she's going to eat. Why are you not eating here? Why do you keep running elsewhere? I guess it's quite common for them to go eat on their beds. I find that happens a lot. Okay, so you, since you're here, we're going to actually have you come and rally the troops because I see that your needs are not very good. So, you know, we're going to make this easier by at least, like, trying to get your needs met a little bit by doing that. And then you're going to go take a thoughtful shower. Have you done all your... You have completed your paintings for work that you needed to do, but we we are... I am sort of aware that I would like to keep her, her notable newcomer status <laughs> up. Is that from bad potty guidance? Yes, it is. It is. So, just, I, uh, oh, she's sad. Why is she sad? She's sad. Oh, she's sad from her bad, her bad, her potty accident. Okay, so you're going to finish eating your food, and you want to play with a toy. Well, think about it. You're getting kind of tired. And why don't you, Oliver, what did you need to do? You needed to paint a mural for two hours. Do we not have a mural down here? Here, we have that one, which I kind of like, and we'll leave it till it starts fading. We're going to continue that mural and leave it at that. And I put him on this because he might, um, he can probably do an actual musical instrument with this musical genius because he should be far enough up. I had wanted her to watch some TV when she was doing that. So he needs to write some bestsellers. And Maya, you're watching TV. You're getting a little bit tired and a little bit hungry. So why don't you come grab yourself a serving? And then maybe, hopefully, you'll actually stay here and watch the TV. I would really like it if you did that. That would be a good thing. And so you're doing that. Good. Lacey, you had your shower. How are your needs? 
Oh, still not very good. So why don't you come over here? Why don't you come here and rally the troops again? Because that you were pretty hungry. Okay, you kind of need to have a a sleep. What you gonna do? You're gonna ask for comfort. Oh, so cute. Oh, Lacey's gonna come comfort you. You know, she's gonna come over here and she's gonna friendly comfort. Poor little, poor little Evie. She's sad from her potty accident. Poor, poor little Evie. Okay, you don't need to talk anymore. I want you to come comfort. Comfort little Evie. I don't know why you're walking all the way over there when she's coming here and she was in the bedroom. Okay, she's sleeping. You look like you need to be sleeping. Okay, you're going to sleep. We'll just leave it at that because I'm having a hard time getting them to... Okay, where did you go, Evie? Outside. In your PJs. Of course. It's cold. So, we're going to hopefully get comforted since you came all the way out here. I don't know that it happened. <laughs> I don't know why you came outside. Oh, she's happy now. That's probably why it canceled. Okay, so can we... Which is her bed? I'm going to assume this is her bed. So we're going to read her to sleep. Yes, it's the only bed available. <laughs> so that must be her bed. Or it's going to be her bed because it's the only place she can go. Now you, Nicholas, I don't know what you're doing. You're going to dance? Yeah. You're going to come here and you're going to... There is a trash can. And the trash can is empty. Oh, finally. Okay. So you're going to come and clean that, and you are going to take a, yeah, you're just going to write a book. You're going to write a genre book. We are going to have you write, I can't remember what I was having him write, if I was having him write any particular type of books. I think he's a geek, which is why I'm going to have him do a science fiction. That's what he's going to do. When he's finished with that. Now she's sad. She's getting her story. She's getting her. Oh, she got to imagination level three. That's good. And then she's going to go to sleep. She's tired from low energy. So they're pretty much, they're going to be sleeping. So I'll be up when, uh, I'll be back when one of them wakes up. Well, it's morning now and I'm gradually waking the kids up. As usual with Jasmine, I tried to have her ask why while she was eating, but she just started talking. She didn't seem to be asking why. She was just randomly talking, um, and she was getting sad because she was getting hungrier and hungrier and hungrier. So, Lacey, my dear, you go to work. Mm hmm. Let's see. Let's see where you are. Let's see. She's painting because I just she needed some fun, so I thought I would have her paint. So she can negotiate a bonus. You're going to stop that painting. You should paint a masterpiece. It was only worth 3,000 something simoleons. And they also sold some of the stuff off the tree. So that helped. So hopefully by the time she gets home from work, this little one will be ready to age up to a child. Because, you know, she doesn't have, she only has to get uh, that thinking up. A little. Maybe, maybe she did get some pluses from asking why, perhaps. And we don't want to view that. We want to say, what's that? That's what we want to do. And you, kiddo, I think you probably used your diaper, I have to say. Oliver, I had him do some writing. Can you come here? I want to see whether you're... So you're not uncomfortable. Usually they're uncomfortable when they're around them if they use their diapers. So maybe he didn't. But I thought he had to go... He still hasn't eaten that food. Why have you not eaten your food that you... I sent you out here to come eat your food. Okay. <laughs> As long as he's hopefully going, I'll need to try and keep a bit of an eye on him to see what's that. And friendly, ask why, see if it works. I'm a glutton. I keep trying it. <laughs> I just would be nice if we could get her to level five in this part, even if we aged her up in the next part, because this part is like almost ready to go. Yeah, so she's getting there. I just, no, we don't want to watch. We want to say, what's that? Nope. <laughs> we got some more uh, royalties. 
So I'm gonna do what's that? Can you do what's that? You can do that on the toy box. Good. You can view that. I don't know that viewing does the same thing, so we're not gonna do that. Yeah, see, I think maybe with the thinking it may when the what's that it's supposed to give you as it showed, it was supposed to boost the thinking. And I think she maybe did get some boosts, even though I didn't see that it looked like she was getting boosts. But now she's just oh now she's asking why. Now she's just talking. She's just talking, talking, talking. Did you eat your food, little guy? Yeah, you did. And you kind of need a bath. And you know what? Where's your potty? Where's your potty skill? It's almost level three. So you're going to come over here and you're going to say go potty. I'm just going to have you go potty. And if by the time you get there, someone can come help you. A little bit too much around, going around in circles when you start asking people to help you go potty. She's at work. I'm not going to bother having her work hard. It's not really important. Now, Evie. Or maybe you're not going potty because Nicholas picked you up. Maya, you have to go potty. Now, which one is Evie? Now, which one is... He's using the pink one. Okay. So, Maya, you need to go potty. You're going to use the green one. And Oliver, you're not doing anything. You're going to clean that. And there's a cat sleeping on the floor. And you are working on, look, 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 can we get it over? Can we, can she get this over that last notch with this, what, what's that on this particular one? Or she's done. No. Can we do it here? Let's try there. Can we try there? Maybe we won't bother waiting for Lacey to come home from work. Maybe we'll just age her up without her because you know, then she can start working on her, her kid things. And we have one last, <laughs> last toddler. Oh my goodness, it's taking it to work. Study shapes. We need you to come get your that last little notch. Yeah, we need you to do that. Yeah, we need you to get that. And she wanted to play with blocks anyways. I didn't even notice. And then she wants to dance. And she wants to ask to be read a book. Well, whatever. What is her trait? She is angelic. Yay! <laughs> I finally maxed one of our toddlers. So we have a pop-up for Lacey. A promising young art student in Lacey's class discovers the brilliant technique of raw goat's milk yogurt tempura painting. She could now borrow this technique for her upcoming big show or let the student take credit. I'm going to give the student credit because I think that's not nice to uh, steal. So we'll see. She loose uses it. Oh, she uses a technique for several pieces in her upcoming show, but invites the student to stand up and receive a round of applause on opening light night. Didn't seem to do anything, but that's fine. That's good. <laughs> no enemies, then. So there's the nanny's doing her cooking. Okay, what you, what do you need, my dear? You're running around. You're a little bit hungry, but, you know, you're not that bad. So why don't we come have you come over here, and um, we'll bring these blocks, and we're going to have you come study shapes. I don't know what you're going to do over there, but I don't care. <laughs> I'm done. I need you to level up. I need you to level up. <laughs> I need you to level up so we can age you up. And uh, um, so Ma so Jasmine is ready to age up because she's maxed everything. What time does she, does our uh, Lacey even get home from work? She gets home at 3. It's not that far, so I think we'll just wait. But, I mean, I don't think there's any chance that Maya will have gotten up high enough by then. But at least you have a good idea of coming over and helping Maya. Right. Let's take a look. He doesn't really care about his needs. And she, what's he doing? We're going to actually rally the troops to keep get your needs back up. Because if you let them get down, then it's harder to keep them up. He is, uh, got stung by the bees. Oh, well. And how are you, before we, uh, why don't, what's your, you're actually, did you go in your diaper too? Because you're not looking like you need to go to the bathroom. So you're going to come grab a serving. But we're going to leave this part here. We have Jasmine ready to age up, but we'll do that in the next part. I'll, um, probably play through and wait for Lacey to get home and make i'll look and see if we have a cake if we need to make a cake if not i'll have nicholas make one but we will do that in the next part but that is it for this part thanks very much for watching and we'll see you next time bye
This has been Jennifer. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below. I'd love to see them. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more videos of challenge Let's Plays, tutorials, and occasional speed builds, please subscribe if you haven't already done so. Thanks very much!